Hey guys, how you doing? Ron Raymond here from the Ram Report, your CFL football preview and prediction on Saturday night's game between the Edmonton Elks and the BC Lions. It is Friday, August 5th. Hope you have yourself a good start to your football Friday. As always, don't forget, subscribe to our channel by tapping that notification bell in the top right-hand corner. Today's podcast is brought to you by the Ram Report Sports Betting Tip Sheet, which fundamentals are based on value percentage play, performance cycles, player availability, and we use a very disciplined money management system. And you can find this system each and every day right here at ATSStats.com. All right, CFL week number nine, and you can see here the uh, Winnipeg Blue Bombers with their win last night. Uh, perfect season on the year, 9-0. and BC 5-1 and on the season. Calgary 4-2. and And uh, going for Edmonton here. 2-5 and five on the season, and they're up against a juggernaut of an offense in the BC Lions. In fact, when you look at the BC Lions on the season, you can see here on offense, they are scoring a lot of points. In fact, this season scoring 34.6 points a game, giving up 20. And for Edmonton, they are averaging 18 points a game and giving up 34.8. But you know what? For um, the Edmonton Elks, they just got to get consistent personnel each and every week. Chris Jones still trying to figure out the... Uh, the, the pieces of the puzzle for the offense and the defense. That's why you're seeing a lot of players shuffle in and out of the Edmonton Elks lineup. Now, going into this game Saturday night at BC Place, the Lions at 12-point favorite. The over-under set at 51 and a half. And let's take a look at the rain report. Rule number one in the sports betting tip sheet, the value on the game Saturday night. You can see here we did have BC listed at minus 13. Bookmakers right there at minus 12. So fair market value if you do like the BC Lions, but I wouldn't be laying 12 points on the Lions. And for the Edmonton Elks, we had them at plus 16. So you're even not even undervalued here on Edmonton. Now the percentage play, a 90.9% .9 chance of winning here for the BC Lions compared to 16%. For Edmonton, the chance of covering the spread, 62% for Edmonton. And the Kogo, the chance of this one going over the total is at 38%, meaning a 62% chance of going under. And that's where I would lean on Saturday's game between the Lions. Doubleheader Saturday, in fact, you got to Hamilton and Toronto in the first game, and then the Lions taking on the Elks in the game number two. And for the Edmonton Elks, when they traveled to BC Place, last 10 trips, four and six straight up, four and six against the number, five four and one when it comes to the over under but uh, i would be leaning towards the under in this one here on saturday night i've got a lot of numbers pointing here towards the under in fact here's a nice league system trend that goes back uh, the last three season any team that's on the um at home on a two-game win streak like the bc lions are the under is 17 and 5 for that team and Edmonton doesn't do well. Look at this number here against those A type teams in the rain report. Teams that have a 60% or higher win percentage. You can see Edmonton 1 and 9 against the number 3, 6, and 2 to the point spread. And the average score is 30 to 15. And according to my math, that's 45 points. And that's where I would lean this Saturday night in the, the doubleheader, the second game of the doubleheader uh, between Edmonton and the BC Lions. Give me the under. Of 51 and a half and the one thing that just before you leave uh, the one thing that uh, the teams are catching on is and really good coaches you know when you're coaching the cfl nfl you're just as a coach you're watching game film every about three to six hours a day right and the one thing people coaches are catching up to Nathan Rourke and that BC line offense. And it, you don't get any better DC than Chris Jones in the CFL. And I think Jones will have uh, a good defensive plan. To, you're never going to stop this offense, but you can slow it down. And that's good news if you like the under. So give me the under 51 and a half this Saturday night at BC Place. There you have it. That is my preview prediction on Saturday night's game between the Edmonton Elks and the BC Lions. Good luck.